Greetings, fellow adventurers. Today, we embark on an exciting journey beneath the depths of the Caribbean Sea to uncover the mysteries of the fiery Kickham Jenny volcano. Fasten your seatbelts, as this promises to be an exhilarating ride. Nestled at the convergence of the Caribbean and South American tectonic plates, this active submarine volcano lies just eight kilometers north of Grenada. Picture colossal slabs of Earth's crust colliding as the South American plate subducts beneath the Caribbean plate, creating a volcanic hotspot along the Lesser Antilles Island arc. Over time, Kickham Jenny has risen from the remnants of a collapsed feature, hinting at a once mighty predecessor that stood as an island above the ocean's surface. Our tale with Kickham Jenny begins in 1939, when a spectacular eruption on July 23rd to 24th propelled steam and debris 902 feet into the air. This explosive event triggered tsunamis, reaching heights of 6.6 .6 feet along the coastlines of northern Grenada and the southern Grenadines. Even the west coast of nearby Barbados felt the ripples. Luckily, no harm was done, but the spectacle left many wondering about the potential consequences of a modern eruption. Unlike their terrestrial counterparts, underwater volcanoes like Kickham Jenny face unique challenges. The high pressure and cooling effects of surrounding water influence their eruptions, shaping the formation of pillow lava. These underwater giants release gases into the water, altering temperature and chemistry. While both land-based and underwater volcanoes pose risks, the former often directly impact human populations due to their proximity to communities. Kickham Jenny, residing off Grenada's northern coast, hosts a significant hydrothermal system this system, concentrated within the volcano's crater, at depths of approximately 265 meters, discharges hot water and gas. This creates a unique ecosystem, shedding light on the intricate interplay between volcanic activity and the marine environment. In a recent chapter of our adventure, between February 9th and 11th, the volcano stirred with heightened activity, a whopping 3,400 recorded events. A pivotal moment occurred on February 10th, marked by a magnitude 3.3 earthquake. Throughout the year, seismic rumblings have been a constant companion. As of the latest update, the volcano has lulled into relative calm. But the burning question lingers. What if Kickham Jenny decided to erupt today? 